Jews. <laughs> they have all been forced by Lord Farquhar to move out of the forest, which has been their home for many moons. The Lord plans on sacrificing the trees from the forest for additional fuel, which he needs to heat his castle in anticipation of having a new bride. All the characters are moving to the swamp, the home of the green ogre. Shrek. <laughs> 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 Who has always enjoyed his privacy. <laughs> there has to be something else Lord Farquhar can do besides cutting down forest and <laughs> <laughs> yes, we must protect the beautiful forest. <laughs> I'd build my castle with a new roof that has a heat shield. <laughs> I'd build mine with more insulating properties. You can't have too many properties. <laughs> I'd build my castle with better windows that are, that are more energy efficient, even though I'm blind and can't see them. <laughs> 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 Where's your request for the user to install the hung device? It's in SharePoint! Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Shrek, donkey, and boots travel to the distant castle, far from his swamp, and encounter the fire-breathing dragon named Ziggy. <laughs> Dragon. Kill me you must to get to Fiona, because I, Zigbee, Alliance Dragon, am here to protect her from those unscrupulous vendors who don't follow the smart energy profile. Both want the same thing. I'm here to take her to Lord Farquhar so he can provision his, his hand device and not cut down the trees in the forest and we can save Mother Nature. It is not nice to say with Mother Nature. <laughs> Come on, Zigbee, help us out here. Fiona's not getting any younger, you know. <laughs> so Shrek and his comrades rescue Fiona. She and Shrek secretly fall in love. <laughs> <laughs> and Fiona confides in the donkey about her being too busy. Prince by day, over by night. She tells him about when she was a 2 0 with fatal error. <laughs> <laughs> but Shrek thinks she's making fun of him. So he delivers her to Lord Farquhar to be married and to claim his very <clears throat> own hand device. But as the days go by, Shrek realizes he's fallen in love with Fiona and is having no luck provisioning the hand device either. <laughs> Finally, Donkey has advice for his friend. <laughs> How long you be sitting around moping over some chip with weird ears? Either move on or do something about it. My friend, it's time we take courage by the hair bar and go after your woman. <laughs> it's too late. The wedding is today. But I could fly you there in no time at all if uh, Donkey here would scratch my ears while we fly. <laughs> Okay, here we go. The dragon, who has a thing for the donkey, lies <laughs> Shrek to the marriage of Fiona and Lord Farquhar, who are just about to marry Fiona. Do you, Lord Farquhar, I mean, this interesting woman. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> Stop! I'm in love with Fiona. And I need her so I can provision the only smart energy profile device known to work with an SR 3.0 meter. Do you expect provision that device? <laughs> <laughs> Look, it says 